Shout out to G-Man Boxing. Quick video, quick post-fight reaction to uh, Victor Faust, also known as Victor Vickhurst, um, alias is Faust, but I'm used to calling him Victor Vickhurst. Uh, Victor Faust versus Agor Kiadzes, or Kaladzes. Um, hadn't planned on doing a review for this fight, was literally getting ready to go to bed, and I said, look, I'll catch the start of this card, see if there's any non-heavyweight fights, so I said, okay, I'll watch it. <laughs> this was a great fight. Um, for all of what it lasted, two and a bit, a little over two rounds. Um, damn, the stoppage was absolute BS. I mean, that was a kind of almost in-house stoppage, if you know what I mean. Uh, not to accuse anyone of anything, but that stoppage, you gotta really raise some eyebrows at that. Seriously, raise some eyebrows at that. Um, this fight started off. T to me, right, when I saw Kalazes before they were doing, before the fight started, when they were doing the, you know, intros, he almost looked a bit, how do I say it? I was kind of looking at him thinking, is he going to go with the first sign of trouble? Because he, he almost looked disinterested, you know, as they were announcing the fighters. And he went down from, Faust landed a right hand followed by a left hook in the first round, and that put Kalazes down. Now, he's been down before in fights, been down several times in fights. Specifically, I think of a fight, FAA Jagba, where he was hurt really, really bad in the third round. And he landed a right hand off the back foot, which dropped FAA Jagba. Now, that raised eyebrows at the time. But I didn't think anything like this would happen again. I thought this was going to be over and done with in a round. And Faust went in for the kill. Got countered, got caught. Well, he actually walked into a right hand. And Kalates was hurt when he went down. But Faust looked way more hurt his legs really did betray him and Faust was down a couple of times in this fight but interestingly right whenever Kaladze's landed even marginally on him he see even with jabs he seemed his legs seemed to stiffen now I don't know whether you could say that was a result of him not fully recovering from the first knockdown potentially it could be because it was his legs did definitely you know go underneath him and maybe they didn't recover but he was definitely buzzed at certain times in this fight so you got to ask a question there but he gets back up, does Faust, and immediately puts Kaladze's down again with another left hook, and he goes down. This time he was bleeding. The referee, the worry I had there was, the referee said, one more time, it's over. And I was like, why? Why one more time, it's over? Yeah, he's been down twice, but he's been able to drop Faust. And Faust looked way more hurt when he went down than Kaladze's did in either knockdown. And, you know, he was warning about hitting the back of the head, which, yes, I understand that. That's fair, warn about that. But the referee really did seem to be, you know, very, very much against Kaladze's. Anyway, first round ends. When's the last time we saw three knockdowns in the first round? This is why I love heavyweight boxing. Heavyweight boxing is the only division where you'd really see that. You know, you might see it, but there'd be very few and far between. Heavyweight boxing, and it can happen. Into the second round. Another knock, well actually a jab from Kaladze stiffened the legs a bit of Faust and almost escapes me now but I think it was the right hand that actually put him down again, put Faust down again. This time he was bleeding, it looked like a bleed on the bridge of the nose and he looked in all sorts of bother. He really truly did, he looked in all sorts of bother. Kaladze went in to go and finish the job, hit him in the back of the head a couple of times, referee pulled him to the corner and said no more basically. No more hitting the back of the head. Okay, fine, fair enough. Faust is able to find the shot. Puts Kalaze down again. And the referee basically... This is the fifth knockdown in this fight, right? Fifth knockdown. Three for Kalaze's, two for Faust, right? Referee asked him, do you want to continue? Doesn't get the response he wants. Waves it off. You could definitely say that Faust was way more hurt in this fight. More often... And with more and with the knockdowns, with the two knockdowns, then Kaladze's was with the three knockdowns. Kaladze's actually tried to go with the ref the referee started kind of getting up, was like, get him out of here, get him out of here. Kaladze's was obviously very upset, um, and rightfully so, it was a BS stoppage. BS stoppage. First fight of 2022, and we get a brilliant fight for all of what it lasted, ruined by a BS stoppage. And it was a BS stoppage, there's no way he was fine, he could have carried on. You could argue at that stage. Kaladze's was still fresher and was still more cognizant than Faust was because Faust had been up and down you know twice and they were heavier knockdowns they were so there we go 
That's that fight over and done with. Faust, I mean, he survived the scare there, but I saw what I needed to see in that fight. I saw what I needed to see. And um, there's there's going to be a lot of... Que- people are going to fancy their chances going in there with him in the future. You know, I keep calling him... I'm used to calling him Victor Vickers. That's his real name. But um, the alias is Victor Faust. Um, yeah. P- I wasn't going to do a review on it, but when a fight goes like this, I got to talk about it. Great fight. BS stoppage. That's what I got to say about that. Um, we'll see how this card goes. I'm not going to cover this whole card. I'm going to go to bed now. It's half one in the morning, probably close to the two now. Uh, so I'm going to go and do the rest of these fights tomorrow. I'll, t- I'll do a review of Ortiz versus Martin, definitely. Um, I wasn't aware Martin was trained by Manny Robles for this fight. No wonder he came in a little bit lighter. Um, that could actually pay dividends to him. So my prediction was Martin to win this fight. If Manny Robles trained him, that could actually be a little bit better now my pick for martin um so that's my thoughts on that let me know yours in the comment section will i put destruction of the title i'll go on it's the first fight of the year you'll see destruction of the title smash the like button if you could subscribe if you haven't already i'll talk to you peeps peace